unboxing day, you know how these things go, baby. I just go back to back to back videos. I am so pumped. I've been stacking up stuff here for left and right. But in today's video, we have the story of the missing lab coat. Flock and Garwood, the missing lab coat that AD Gets Buckets sent us. And I had a crazy time getting this bad boy. Shout out to Rebel Tank Customs for being able to actually provide this. You'll find that in the story. And I also have definitely my worst and first eBay purchase of the year. And it's June. Let's get into it. Hope you guys enjoy. Those gosh darn damn Facebook groups. I see a post for a certain figure and I'm like, ooh, that's nice. I'm not gonna ask where you got it from, but guess what? Someone already did and they shared what it was. So I then decided to get it. It's for a DBZ figure line. It's not even an SH figure art, but there's one specific character in there that I really like and I've been in search of and I had no idea how to ever find it. So I purchased this off of eBay. I don't want to know what the price tag in there. I don't even know if there's anything else in there. Nice wrapping, by the way. Got you, bro. This is a Dragon Ball Z collecting Irwin Toys. So if you're looking for this damn thing, Irwin Toys. Master Roshi. Now you're probably saying to yourself, Cletus, what the fuck are you collecting? You just because you're wearing the outfit, now you're collecting these things? No, absolutely not. We do not want anything in here besides this flocking turtle. Yes, I wanted this turtle to go with my SH Figure Watch collection, Master Roshi Dragon Ball series. Again, the company's called Irwin. I got it off eBay. Pretty cool, pretty detailed. Irwin's the company. Then let's run in this bad boy. So many of you guys seen my video when I go pick up my P.O. Box order. Ah! <laughs> you sent me the fucking sandal. And in that video, you guys seen me take the Beast Lab coat put it in my mother flocking pocket, right? Oh, beast lab coat. I take it, I put it in my pocket, say, no, I would have ran home like this. Then I go and I take the envelope and I throw it in the box. Bastard. I gotta run home with this. I didn't bring my car. Not remembering that I have this flocking thing in my jacket. I pick up the box. I have no knowing where to throw it out. I throw it away. Uh, I found some to throw this in. Problem is this. The box was freaking this big and filled with Rice Krispie treats. Damn, these things are delicious. Mm. I was switching arms. Right arm, left arm, right arm, left arm, high, low, double arming it all the way back home. It was like a two mile run. First day back after suffering the coronavirus and in the actual working out method, by far was the worst. The worst. Ah. Ah. Show Punky it. She's like, who's it from? I said, I don't know. Go on the computer, go start editing my videos. And I go, oh, let me go open that beast real quick. I open the bag up, it's not in there. Check my pockets, it's not in there. I am flocking lit. I said, you know, the guy sent it to me. I don't know how much it cost. I gotta go find it. I go, Punky took my car. I go jump in her car. Battery don't start. I gotta go grab the charger. Boom, 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 start the car up. I gotta go down to the post office. I'm driving down the road like this. Trying to find this flocking thing. Get to the post office, I search that whole area, I start digging into the sewer, I see nothing. And then I'm like, you know what? Maybe I left it inside that box. Maybe I left it inside that box. So what do I do? Alright, let me go walk over the dumpster. This area is actually not my area. It's not even my complex. I have nothing to do with it. I walk over to the apartment complex. There's nobody really over there. Go in the back, there's the dumpster, and there's a mother flocking stray cat like I'm like, oh boy, you better move, man. Get, get on, get, get out of here. 
yeah. He sees I'm still walking. I'm still walking, he backs off. I said, well, I gotta get the box. I see where it is. Son of a Go into the dumpster, climbing in there, one foot in, grab the box out. I'm in a dumpster. 33 years old. What the fuck am I doing in a dumpster? I go open the box up, what's inside? The envelope, it says flocking earth nail. I go, oh, you mother flocking garwood. I couldn't find a damn lab coat on my ride. So I say, you know what, let me head back. I'll look on the other side of the road, maybe I lost when I was running. Driving, driving, driving. Oh, it was like a piece of paper over there. Let me pull over, er, er, the, the turnpipe to do the eight. Come back, park the car, run over there. It's not it, son of a Go back in the car, park the car. I'm so pissed now that I'm like, I'm going for a run. I'm not wearing no headphones. I'm just gonna do it up and I'm running like this because where I live, you know, we don't live in nice wealthy areas. There's sh** in the ground. And because there was so much stuff on the ground, I'm like, run all the way there. Nothing. I run all the way back. Nothing. I get back to the house. I said, let me hit up Idiot's Buckets. Let me play a little game with him. I said, oh man, that jacket is flocking lit, yo. It was so off the charts. Where do you get that? You got that from GPS spot on eBay? He's like, no, nah, I got it from Rebel Tank Customs. I said, oh really? Okay, thanks. Looks really nice. Go hit up Rebel Ted. I said, hey, you got this? She's like, yeah. And then I was like, oh, I see other stuff on your site too. Can I get that too? So I grabbed a bunch of other things to add in this order so I can make it at least somewhat flocking lit. Whoo! Got it in now. I gotta say, I am a 33-year-old man, a world-ranked professional boxer, a somebody in actual, you know, in the sports world. Rank, I'm a ranked fighter. I think 11 right now. And it didn't matter. Somebody sent me something. I wanted to go out there. Proved to myself that I did everything I could to find it, and I couldn't. Shout out to you, and shout out to any mother flocker that thought I was gonna go out of my way and ask anybody, what the hell am I looking for? People saw me going up and down, I was like, I can't ask these people. Hey guys, uh, did you see my um, 1 12th scale uh, beast lab coat? It's white, and It goes to my Marvel Legend. It's, you know, about six, seven inches, a little wide. It's white. It's a lab coat, you put it on them. No, I couldn't ask that question. And I definitely didn't ask that question to the little kids that were hanging out here because they would have definitely called the cops on me. I would have been screwed on that. And I don't even know if I could say, hey, do you guys find my jacket for my doll? No? Well, that's good, thank you. Inside here, what is this? We got a lab coat, and I upgraded it. I threw the book in there too, so I bought the damn lab coat and the book. I can't wait to put it on the fig. I wanna thank you, Rebel 10 Customs, for that, having it on there with the book, woo! And shout out to you, A.D. Gets Buckets. Second, I picked up the jacket as well. This can go on Beast or this can go on Thing. I thought if I was gonna pick up the Marvel Legends Thing exclusive, well, I could take the common one and put the jacket on him. And then lastly, she always throws like a little gift in here when you do these little orders. And if you're looking for her stuff, check her out on Instagram. She has a eBay page and an Etsy page. Go check her out, hit her up on the PMs, and you can get the price a little bit cheaper. We got a 112th scale camera. Much love, much love. That goes with every figure, this is great. <laughs> I like it, I'll probably put it on my Spider-Man. Mayfax, beautiful. Thank you so much, Rebel 10 Customs. Thank you, AD Gets Buckets. Thank you for tuning into this video, guys. It's absolutely the most ridiculous video that I have ever created of me complaining about absolutely the most dumbest stuff. But I will say this at the end, I guarantee you, if you said that shit to Jetta, that mother would have been like, whatever, and left you guys stranded, no put no work in, 
because he don't show that love and that passion that somebody sent you something, went out of their way, spent their own money on it. You gotta do whatever you can to get it. See you guys in the next one. Boom! Most lit thing I've done in years. Just driving on my bicycle, my cans on the front. Cash in my cans. Head over to KB Toys for a little bit. After we head over to KB, me and my pops, we stop over to the local VHS space. And guess what? Since I'm older now, I can go head over inside the adult section. And man, I wore out them tapes. I'm gonna prove you wrong. Or I'm gonna prove you right. Don't say I don't warn you. Look at that turtle. Oh, I told you, I told you. Oh. Look at that bad boy. You want to get some poo time in the schoolyard? Look at that. Woo! Oh, baby!